Hello and welcome to Bomb Bomb B Place Transport Fever Friday Fever. I'm Bomb Bomb B, and of course you are very very welcome. But you knew that, didn't you? Right. Well, the game has started upgrading on itself now. We are up to 1939. I am about 20 million overdrawn. Oops. Uh, let's have a quick look at the towns and how they're progressing because we are, like I say, we're now 1939 and if I, we are, we are currently on pause and for a reason, I'll, I'll get to that in a moment. But see how the roads have been upgraded and how, uh, how sharp they're looking. If we go out of town now along this route, you'll see that our country lanes have also been upgraded as well. Hasn't happened across the map yet, but it's a slow process. So there's a, that one there, like down over here, this one. This one still hasn't been upgraded, and this will happen in time across the map, slowly but surely. Right, so, well, I've done a few things off camera. Now, one of the problems that I've I've come across, and this is this is a bomb bomb problem, not a game problem. It's when you um when you build lines, the trains will automatically navigate to the right-hand line because um, trains go on the right, don't they? Yeah. Apart from one little place in the world, or maybe a few others, but uh, the United Kingdom, where I reside, um, the trains, like the cars, will go on the left. And of course, I autopilot automatically every time I play this game. <laughs> Just assume that the uh, trains are going to go on the left. And I need to remember that they'll go on the right. I'd ignore the flashing sign up here. We'll get to that in a minute. Don't worry. So, um... So yes, uh, so when I set these lines up, I just forget this. And then I end up with trains going nose to nose because you'll get one coming up one way, one coming down the other way. Both trying to go down the same line because I'm automatically assuming that, uh, anyway, I've set, I've set things up anyway. Anyway, I've been spending time um, putting in waypoints, forcing trains to drive on the left as I've kind of been setting up the lines to work that way. It's a little bit frustrating and a little bit annoying, I know. But uh, that, that's where we are anyway at the moment with that. So I've done a little bit of this off of camera. Another thing we've done off of camera. Oh, well, we've done our first fuel delivery to um, to Glastonbury. That was very profitable. Our very first drop off, and we made three a million. Anyway, so we've got all these lines coming down here, merging into two. I've now put in the second line along here, which um, I think we did. Actually, we already had two lines along to this point. Put the second platform here at the uh, food processing plant, which is there. And then we're putting a second line all the way up now, all the way along here to Glastonbury right at the very top, where um, it meets the station. I've decided to go with one platform on the station. For now, we can upgrade it. I thought about upgrading it um, when I upgraded the lines, but when it puts in the second platform, it's putting it on this side, this, this side of the platform so um and the second line that i was putting in was the one on the left hand side here and it was just a little bit awkward and i got a bit sad about it and and, and had for a hissy fit and uh, decided to just leave it you've got one platform and you can deal with it right okay so that's done now where were we where were we now one thing we need to do today is um the train let's have a quick look at the trainsy see what the trains is doing this trainsy is uh Carrying 27 people on the first line, and it is the um, the Mr. Miyagi. We started renaming our trains after beloved creators within the City Skylines uh, City Skylines community. This one down here, this one is the uh, this is the Bomb Bomb Foodathon. Hasn't actually been upgraded. Once it well, when we upgrade that one, it's still making money. There we are, still making money across the whole. Uh, when we need to upgrade it, we will, and we will give the new train a shiny new name. Right, and now, um, let's head back to the other side of the river, because we have a little bit of a problem. Not a huge problem, but a little bit of a problem. What we have here, this is um, a carryover from when I first set up this line, and there was only one fuel train. Now we have two fuel trains. We have... Uh, we have this fella, and this is the Icania, and that is on the Glastonbury fuel run. This is the one that just gave us three million profits, which is quite good. We need to get him rolling as soon as possible. He, however, can't go any further because he wants to go onto the line here, this one here, where we've got the Carnador, which is the Mitcham fuel run. 
um, which is also trying to get onto the same line. Basically, they're nose to nose, and we can't go any further until this is resolved. So I'm going to have to borrow some more money. <laughs> We're getting a bit close to our limits here, guys. We are getting a little bit close to our limits. Uh, what we're going to do, I think, we'll probably back the uh, the Karna door up a little bit. And I'll put a secondary line. Let's have a look down here where this platform, this platform is up. We've got the second station, uh, sorry, second line at this platform. We'll extend this one out, first of all, and I'm just remembering which is the rotate keys. I'm still middle mouse button is not working in this game for me very annoying and frustrating and annoying and a pain in the bottom as well all right so we need to borrow some money that's basically most of our money spent there right borrow um borrow everything we can and then we'll repay it all there we are we are capped out there 30 million we have no more funds available but uh, 9 million is going to be more than plenty for what we need to do with this little job First of all, we come over to this and we'll just extend you out that way. Uh -huh. Now, how are we going to do this? Ah. <laughs> okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to demolish some line. I'm going to demolish that line there. And, yeah, and that one. Then we'll connect those two up, like so. And we're going to connect that one along this way. And we must remember to put some waypoints down on this as well. Must remember. Don't let me forget to put down waypoints. Uh huh. This comes up alongside here. This thing goes up a little bit further to about there. Ooh, now this is going to be a bit messy, but I think it we can make it work. Right. So first of all, we'll draw that line out a little bit and uh, probably not let me do it because there's a train on there. Okay, okay. Uh, pause, we'll stay, keep the game in pause. Take that off. You, stop. You, backwards. Just a little bit. Just a wheezy bit. Then keep going, keep going, keep going, baby. Keep going. And... You can now stop. That's better. Now, we'll grab the line here and drag it out and connect you up to there. Nice. We've only got the one line here. This is going to be a little bit... Uh, look at the traffic. Look at the cars. <laughs> They've been waiting for the... Uh, the train to clear the uh, level crossing and uh, finally he has so uh, that was a bit troublesome right um we we don't need to upgrade that just yet right so what we'll do then is we're going to pop down a waypoint over here uh train rail 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 waypoint about there okay good 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 now uh lines Lines, lines tool, lines tool is there. Right, the Glastonbury fuel run. After visiting, what is this? Where are we? Um, after visiting, do 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 do. Um, is this Mitchum? This is must be Mitchum. Your next port of call will be that one. Right. You can now go back the way that you were planning on going. Where's our... Where's our... <laughs> where's our engine? So hopefully that's just an error. Did I... Did I just... Look. Reverse that way. Where's our... Our, our engine is there. And our engine is gone. Um, you can unstop. Oh no, it's reappeared. Whew. That was a little bit of a little bit of a sweaty sweaty moment. Right. How about why are you not going anywhere? It can you? Um, Glastonbury fuel run. And you should. Uh, we'll put actually we'll stick a quick um. Stick a quick. Not waypoint. 
And that's the one. Signal. And we'll get that out of the way so I can see what I'm doing. There. How about that? Now, can you now very kindly get rolling? Um, who's moving? It's this one. We un unstop you. Yes, you're moving. And we can unstop you, but you're waiting for the free path. Which should now free up. We should now free up. Okay, let's just make doubly sure that these guys pass each other. Hopefully. And yeah, that's that's good. That's that's what we wanted to see. Right, now let's have a look on the other side of this platform. We have got a line here. Let's draw out a new line, shall we? Not a new line, but a secondary line. Why are we not that's the one. Now, it's been pointed out in the comments, and I'm sorry, I forgot to check who it was, but you know who you are. Um, somebody gave me some really good advice, in fact, a lot of good advice, about um, uh, why my train's not going to reach top speed. Like, uh, these trestles, the top speed for a train on the trestles is only 60. And, um, of course, I should really be seeing this. It does actually tell you here, like as we're coming down the slope here, 97 and 120 are the, the top speeds here and here. So it does actually tell me as I'm going. Um, yeah, a good, really good advice. Thank you very much for all of that. Um, I will be bearing it all in mind as I go. Uh, let's draw out this line here. Yeah, we can actually connect this one all the way across, can't we? Let's do that. Let's do that. Will you connect up? Collision. Damn it. Let's draw that back a little bit. And maybe from there. Duplicate segment. A little bit tetchy. There, that's more like it. Right, we are all connected there as well. So, now. Now, let's have a look at these lines then. See how they work through here line the first line yeah that is going to go across it mind you it's the only passenger train running along so i don't mind that doubling back on itself that is fine the glastonbury fuel line let's get rid of this one and uh, move that out of the way now that decides it's going to cross across to that side why ah is because it's bypassing the station or is it coming through the station here? That's a little bit of a pain in the bottom. The Glastonbury fuel line is... Yes, we can do better with that one. Of so many waypoints, it's becoming a really bit messy, to be honest with you. I'd rather, I would much rather... Um, let's do this, right. Um, we'll have a way, we've got a waypoint. These, this is just lots and lots of signals right so we'll have a waypoint there Glastonbury fuel line so after what's this this is going <coughs> oh, excuse me pardon me I try not to cough but sometimes these things these teams things sneak out Goulston right after Goulston come on this way after Goulston and there is the waypoint so that Glastonbury fuel line after Goulston where's that one where is that one ah I don't know let's have a look um, so let's call this up um, signals and waypoints that could be it there but why is that okay Goulston Waypoint. Let's remove Goulston Waypoint. Go there and do make him coming to this platform here. Come, what? Why are you not? That's very annoying. This is where it starts getting, getting a bit fiddly. Bear with me a second while I have a proper look at this. And we've got a collision as well. What is going on here? Ah, lines reporting. Yeah, the gas refuel. That that's probably a problem. Just caused by me. Bear with me one moment. I will come back and have a look at this and see exactly where I'm going wrong. Won't be a moment. 
Okay, I think I've just fixed that. It was um, getting in the muddle with the waypoints. Unfortunately, uh, I, I, well, unfortunately, I have managed to fix it, sort it all out. Took me a while. But um, yes, just trying to get the trains to go down the right line. And now, basically, the, uh, the fuel run should go down this left-hand track rather than doubling up on this right-hand track, which was going to be a bit of a pain in the bottom. Now, what we're going to do is let's repay all this money. Oh, we just got a nice little chunk of cash come in there. Let's repay everything that we can afford to repay so that we don't get hit by massive in interest payments, uh, charges even. And uh, right, so we're into 1940. So let's have a look. Let's have a look at our um, our uh, industry and see what how they're how they're coping. We've got the oil well production is 76 at the moment with a limited of 800, and um, we do need to get that rolling. Uh, they've got a lot of uh, fuel sat on the platform. A lot of fuel. This is going to be, I think, producing most of our cash. Now this guy here, this is going to, this is empty at the moment. He is on the Mitcham run, so he's backwards and forwards. He's currently doing a lot of work to Carnador. A lot of work. And then uh, over here we've got the oil refinery, which is running at 78 of a limit of 400, and that's all pretty cool as well. Got a fair amount of fuel sat on the platform waiting to go there. And then if we go across to the farm. The farm loads sat on the platform there, 165, and the farm is running at just 62. We need to get that upgrading and running a lot more efficiently as well as soon as we can. And then over here, oh, we've got a train over here. The, the, uh, the food processing plant, there is food sat. Once again, not too much of it. You can see the old crates there waiting to go. Um, so that's not too bad as well. And then we roll up here through the steam and the smoke and the steam and then this one is oh he's this is the can this is going to produce us a big chunk of money waiting for a free path why why are you waiting for a free path ah because this guy's just leaving the station so what we could probably do to help him along is we stick another another signal a little bit closer he can get a little bit closer to the platform and that makes a lot of sense. That was a cheap and easy way of fixing that little problem, I think. Right, so the food the food train is going back empty at the moment. Yes. The Icania, come on Icania, get up the hill, you old boy. You can do it. And that, I would imagine, is going to produce us, uh, so hopefully about another three million. This is a, gonna be very profitable. You have a look at the uh, of truck stop over here. Is uh, loading up nicely. We've got the trucks running along. 24 on the uh, in the truck stop waiting, and this is going to fill it. If I move this over here, you can see this in operation now. How this kind of works. If we've, we don't think we've done this. A lot of you will have played the game before, but let's have a look and see. This will show us how much money we're being made from here, and then you'll see all the fuel coming up and stacking up at the truck stop waiting for our trucks to come and collect and we'll follow one of them along and just actually have a look at it in in action shall we i think i like the idea of that right okay here comes the Acania. Uh, put the brakes on now my friend put the brakes on uh, hopefully about three million would be lovely 2.83 that'll do that will do and now you'll see it loading immediately into the truck stop here i say loading immediately well, come on now I would have thought. Now on zero, where's where's all the fuel? Where where's all this new stuff? Why is it not suddenly appearing? On the <laughs> oh, there we are. It is there. It's just just not showing up extra. But yes, we've now got 72 fuel and 24 food on there. We've got the truck here, and he is currently carrying eight fuel, and he's going to go about on his routes. Um, yeah, there's a truck stop up here, so we'd be going dropping it off here, which will supply the food, the fuel to this area. And I believe we've got another truck stop the other side of town. I can't remember where the other truck stop is. Where, where would the other truck stop be? Have I got another one? Uh, shall we go into um, into that mode there? Truck stop, there, bus and tram stops, stations, road vehicles. Where, where's the truck stop option? 
state was well, gonna be stations there we are right at the top that was the one there we go and then that supplies that whole area up there so i think we're doing okay up here you know that's definitely producing us some money shall we repay some more of this stuff so that we don't get uh, any interest where are we uh, we're down to yeah 18 18 million well we started off owing 20 million today we've got it down to 18 now one thing that we're gonna have to keep an eye on oh we've got another collision problem up here quickly pause the game so we don't lose too much time or whatever the Carnador and the Miyagi are having a bit of a snog of course they are what's going on with you guys I thought I'd fix this I thought I had fixed this why are you being so petty and why is my keyboard not working bear with me a second right I have now switched over from a Wi-Fi keyboard to a wide keyboard and hopefully we are now fixed right now where are we why is this train on that platform this train the Carnador which is the no we are in Goulston East I can see that oh we are on the Mitcham oil line so we need to sort this out what the hell the Mitcham oil line okay I get that okay let's go back to lines lines Mitcham oil well I've done that why are you not highlighting the line for me I would like to be able to see it's ah now it, if I pull back it does well it doesn't show me before that is annoying to say the least but I haven't got any waypoints on the Mitchum oil line so that would be why we've got a problem here so what if I put in a waypoint here that will that will get things rolling again and then we'll fix this right so first of all you are at what station are we here this is the Goulson transfer so there so what we'll do is we'll we need a waypoint so let's go to rail select the waypoint we'll stick a waypoint we can change lines where we can change lines here so waypoint right there then add that waypoint over there now you're going to bypass each other that's great except for we also will want you on this line here going through that station so we'll have a we'll add another waypoint so many waypoints i need to need next time i play this game i need to get organized with waypoints and put them in when i get started right so we'll have one of those so immediately before gorson transfer right there and we will add that waypoint which will get you onto that line cool and then hopefully before then where have I got another waypoint have I got call up signals where's have I got another waypoint along here I don't believe I have well okay we'll, we'll, we'll pop one in immediately before so we'll do that we'll call that one up we'll have another waypoint right there which will ensure that you are on the correct line hopefully um glastonbury fuel no is it glastonbury fuel um i don't remember what 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 line are we on um let's come out of this click on you your mitchum oil line right okay mitchum oil line get rid of you Mitchum oil line and um, I'm confused again now first of all why can't you connect to all stations why why can you not connect to all stations and why are you coming why do you want to come back down this line oh you are being an annoying little git you are being so right okay remove the waypoints right now we're going to fix this we are going to do this now in the next few minutes we'll get rid of that right Mitch let's go right back to the beginning and we'll follow this and we'll just make absolutely sure you go on exactly the lines we want you to 
So you go from rich and west, that's good. And then you would go, have you not got a uh, connection for the, oh no, because it's just the one line. I'm, I'm going to Lally again. Okay, down here, around here, onto this line. I'm happy with this. Not happy with the way it's on this line coming back as well, but we'll just follow it along. This is good. Then you go into here, you pick up the fuel. Then you go over the bridge, that's good. And then, um, yeah, happy with the line you're taking there. That is good. And then the line just stops being highlighted. That's not very helpful. But, pretty sure we know. Okay, let's, let's put this waypoint in over here, right? So, as we were, as we were immediately after Goulston transfer, hang on a second, hang on a second, you should just be going straight through this, this station. So, why are we not going through just here? Ah, okay, so, Mitchum, Goulston, Goulston, Oh no, you're coming. This is the Mitchum line, Bomb Bomb. Not the Glastonbury line, Bomb Bomb. That's exactly where you want it to be. So, right, so, yeah, okay, right. <laughs> right, Coulson transfer. Okay, add that waypoint. That's exactly what we. What I just did is exactly what we wanted to do, which is stick you onto there. And then you stay on this line. But now you've decided you want to switch over to this line. So we stick in a waypoint on here as well. Bing. Right. Then after that, you go through this waypoint. Bing. Now you're on a separate line. This is better. This is much healthier. Oh. I wish I didn't live in a place that drove on the right side of the road and everybody in the, else in the world drove on the other side. Right. Okay. Now, in theory, all things being well with the following wind, when I click play, when I click play, the car on the door is going to switch over. It's going to move, it's going to switch over to the other side, allowing the Ikania, no, no, the, the Miyagi, not to have to snog him on the beat, on the bridge. Because car on the door and Miyagi snogging on the bridge is probably not something that most of us want to see <laughs> there might be some pervs out there that want to see that but um yeah hey now we're rolling again how many people we've got on the train there just 26 i think the train I, i'm sure i'm sure we were collecting more passengers before this before adding 10 to them but 10 to them doesn't seem to be uh there's not many people wanting to get on the train here this is weird that's the fuel. There won't be any passengers there. There will here though. This is where 21 passengers. Ah, oh, it's not too bad. Maybe it's picking up. It does seem to be quite a small town though. That would be possibly part of the problem. If I pull back, why are you not showing me the town names? Oh, you're being so annoying. Um, oh, there you go. Towns. That's what you want. Ten to them. There we go. Population just 156. So. At least we're providing 45% of its shopping facilities for food, I guess. That's something. <laughs> Glastonbury, on the other hand, is a bigger town. Maybe, maybe in the next episode, we will come and put a passenger station at Glastonbury because it's twice the size. So we hopefully get twice the, uh, twice the travellers and it'd be one extra stop. So maybe, maybe that's going to be the way to go. Well, I, I feel a bit stressed today. I feel a little bit stressed. This game should not be as stressful as it is sometimes. But as like I say, most of it is just down to me putting the trains on the wrong side of the track when I started up the game. But I do it every single time. It's my third, my third recorded playthrough, about my fifth actual playthrough. Every single time these guys get put on the wrong side of the track. Um, yeah, that's oil going up to, uh, to Mitchum brilliant anyways that will do for today that's half an hour of me not wanting to play this game anymore <laughs> thank you very much for watching for commenting for liking and for subscribing 
and for anything else you do thank you so much for all of it because you guys are just wonderful people um uh, join me tomorrow for what map for city skylines and then uh, the new steam chart show on the weekends join me for those i have a lot of fun making them and uh yeah just just join me <laughs> why watch anything else on youtube when you can just join me every single day of the week you my friends are very very welcome